The Organizational Analysis of the Casper College Goodstein Foundation Library The Casper College Goodstein Foundation Library, also known as CCGFL, is located in Casper, Wyoming. CCGFL serves both the college and community of Casper. The library is looking to improve on its services, virtual presence, and partnerships. We have improved and updated CCGFL's original mission, vision, and value statements to better reflect the organization's goals and purposes. These statements center around the library's academic and community surroundings and how to improve on programs and services to provide for its patrons. In order to determine what goals to set forth, we performed an environmental scan and SWOT analysis of CCGFL. The environmental scan consists of researching the demographics of the state of Wyoming, evaluating the academic environment, and looking into legislative and funding. We also took into account the library's physical space, database and physical collection, and technology. We looked at the library's strengths, weaknesses, opportunities, and threats as well. The state of Wyoming has a population of just 573,720 and is the lowest recorded population of all the states. 48.94% of the population is female and 51.06% is male. The most populated counties in the state are Laramie County and Natrona County, with Natrona being home to CCGFL. 91.2% of people are Caucasian and Wyoming has the 7th largest Indian reservation. English is the predominant language in the state. For residents over the age of 25, 92% have a high school diploma or higher. The average earnings are just over 37,000, with males earning an average of 20,000 more than women. Christianity is the prevailing religion in Wyoming, with 66% of the population affiliated with this religion. Wyoming is made up of 83% Republicans, 12% no lean, and 5% Democrats. CCGFL is an academic library primarily utilized by the students of Casper College. Casper College is the largest community college in Wyoming, with 140 academic and technical programs. Casper College accommodates students from across Wyoming, the United States, and around the world. The college serves a population of approximately 3,500 students. CCGFL maintains a partnership with the University of Wyoming, Wyoming Library Databases, and the Wyoming Community College Commission. Through the Wyoming Library Databases Network, the library is able to obtain resources, ebooks, library catalogs, systems management, and library management solutions. The state of Wyoming provides funding for Casper College based on enrollment. The college allots the library a portion of the money to be used to pay the bills, purchase materials, and cover the salaries for work-study students. The college is part of a consortium with the state library. Because resources are shared, funding for the state library has a direct impact on CCGFL. The University of Wyoming is another source of funding for CCGFL. Because of the partnership between the University of Wyoming and Casper College, the university provides a portion of the funds for the purpose of purchasing books and databases. A final source of funding for CCGFL is the Casper College Foundation. The foundation just completed a one-time infusion that is to be spent on books for the library. The library is a two-story building with two state-of-the-art classrooms and special meeting spaces. Nine study rooms, a quiet study space, and collaborative group study spaces are also offered. A meditation room is available to current students. The library has access to almost 400 databases and 1,200 electronic journals. 70,000 volumes are physically available as well as 35 print periodicals. The library also provides interlibrary loan services for any materials not available. The library offers 26 computers and 5 iMacs for student use throughout the building. Community patrons are able to use two of the public use computers. There are three printers, a photocopy machine, and a book scanner available. There is free Wi-Fi, charging stations, and multiple study carols. Students are able to check out laptops, Chromebooks, and iPads while at the library. Partnerships with the Wyoming State Library and the Wyoming Community College Commission has led to an increase in funding and shared resources. With funds from the Casper College Foundation, the library uses the Bowker Book Analysis System to help determine which books to purchase to improve the collection of materials for users. The number of users has increased in the last four years with gate count on the rise. The staff is remarkably dedicated and volunteer their own time to support the library. The librarians work hard to secure grants and even put aside time to evaluate sources in students' research papers.
Weaknesses in the library have been created with the lack of funding. In the last seven years, library staff has been reduced from 14 to just nine full-time staff members. Due to the shortage of staff, hours have also been reduced. Casper College has been experiencing a decrease in enrollment numbers, impacting the library's budget. The library could use more online documentation on how to use the databases. With decreased hours in staffing, it is important for the library to implement a program such as Ask a Librarian to allow students to seek help during the times when the library is closed or not staffed with a reference librarian. There are approximately 29,000 fewer items available for circulation compared to community colleges with similar enrollment sizes. Due to staff shortages, the Natrona County Public Library will be closing on Sundays. CCGFL will be opening 12 p.m. to 8 p.m. on Sundays, giving community patrons a place to utilize. This would be an excellent time to look into increasing the amount of leased books to improve the collection for the community patrons. Several new sources of funding for library materials have been acquired in the last few years. Ongoing grants and funds can be used to improve the physical collection. The lack of funding for resources and staff would affect the library's ability to function. CCGFL created their first strategic plan for 2018 to 2021 and are still behind schedule in the planning process. The drop in student enrollment is another threat to be addressed in collaboration with the college. After performing an environmental scan of Casper College Goodstein Foundation Library and its surroundings, as well as a SWOT analysis of the library, we recommend the following five goals. In the interest of time, I will go over one objective and one action plan per goal. Goal one is to facilitate academic success. To do this, the library must partner with faculty to improve the academic programs of the college by advancing information literacy and critical thinking skills. The library will develop a program during summer 2019 to include library literacy instruction in the curriculum of all academic programs. Courses such as English and Psychology already utilize library instruction literacy, and the goal will be for all general education courses to include library instruction literacy in their curriculum. This instruction will be phased in over the 2019 to 2020 academic year. Goal two is to develop collaborative services and partnerships with faculty, campus, community, and Wyoming libraries. The library will host events and programming that will encourage faculty, students, and community members to utilize the library. Beginning fall 2019, each class with the instructor will take a guided tour of the library sometime in the first month of each semester, after which there will be snacks provided during a Q&A. Follow-up will be a short questionnaire to each instructor and student requesting input on what would be most helpful to them at the library. Additionally, current library staff approaches on programming and events seem quite successful and we will continue those patterns. Director of the library will assess creating a Friends of the Library program beginning spring 2019. Goal 3 is to create a strong organized web presence allowing library users to interact with the library virtually. With the shortened library hours and reduced staff, it is essential to implement a virtual Ask a Librarian program by 2021. To do so, the library will determine software necessary for the chat function, including costs and support, and determine staffing levels needed and assignments of retrieving questions when offline. Goal 4 is to improve library spaces with all uses considered. Due to the closures of Natrona County Public Library on Sundays, CCGFL has become a hotspot for community patrons. To better suit this demographic, it is important to expand the library's popular fiction and young adult user space beginning 2019. Currently, the popular fiction and young adult book and user space is located in the corner on the second floor. Expanding this space to include modern lounge seating will enhance this area and encourage users to utilize this reader-friendly space. Adding attractive directional signage to the first floor stairs will further encourage usage. The final goal is to recruit, retain, and develop library personnel with commitment to profession and service. One way to do this is to encourage library personnel to participate in campus and community engagements. With increased work responsibilities due to staffing shortages, current library employees are extremely busy with their day-to-day -day work. While these daily responsibilities are important, it is also valuable to participate in campus and community engagements. Employees will be encouraged to serve on campus, community, and global committees, and their workload should reflect this service. Arrangements to compensate employees with time off to volunteer either cam on campus or in community will also be established.
This strategic plan thoroughly addresses the strengths and weaknesses of CCGFL explored in part one of the organizational analysis and best positions the library to fully realize its potential over the next three years. A strong staff and collaboration relationships are maximized in the objectives. Weaknesses in declining enrollment, funding, and limited online library instruction are addressed with initiatives such as Ask a Librarian chat line, formation of a Friends of the Library organization, and development of video instruction on library functions. Investment in faculty relationships and student education is addressed in numerous objectives objectives as well as steps to developing close ties with the college president. Community events continue at their strong pace with more efforts made to survey the user experience in order to improve it at all levels. The goals include broadening staff involvement in statewide organizations and playing a stronger role in curriculum development and support. These aggressive objectives and others are directly in line with cutting-edge goal-setting theory and will inspire the CCGFL staff to deliver excellence and model it for students, community members, and Casper College peers alike.